So I found this really interesting ladder in an auction. I'm super excited about it. I had to fix it up a little bit and do a couple different things to it. I had to clean it. I had to fix a few broken parts on it. But other than that, it's a beautiful old ladder. So let me show it to you real quick. Okay, so here's the ladder. It's about 10 feet long in total. Uh, obviously, it's missing a couple rungs. But I, I got it at the auction for $2. Couldn't pass that up. It was pretty sweet. So, there were a couple things wrong with it, um, besides the missing rungs, there's a split right here, and I fixed that with wood glue, and then there's a patch, there were, well there was a hole above that rung, and this rung, and I filled those with wood putty, and then I colored them with colored pencil. So, anyway, with this project, there's a couple things you're gonna need. Ceiling hooks. Unless you have wood ceilings where you don't have to drill a hole, you're going to need a drill. And you're going to need a drill bit that is as wide as the wings once they're closed. Or once these are closed so that they can go through the ceiling and then open up. And then that is what the hook is going to hang from. And I just happen to have green chains. I don't know if the color's going to work so well, but I feel as if it's all going to come together just perfectly. And all this material I pretty much had lying around the house except for the ceiling hooks. Also, you're going to need something to attach the chains to the ladder with. So I went with these simple wall hooks. Just make sure they're big enough to carry the weight of the ladder. This here is pure science. Trying to figure out where I want to hang the ladder. I don't really recommend that you do it that way, but that's what worked for me, so don't judge. <laughs> Nothing little spackling can't fix if I mess it up. Alright, so now I'm taking these, close it like that, and put it into the hole I created with the dirt. Of course, they are too big. Ugh. I'm really hoping that'll work. Okay. There it is, a real thing of beauty. Alright, so. You want those wings to open up on the inside. So. Okay. There we go. And, like a Neanderthal, I left fingerprints on my nice white ceiling. I tend to eyeball a lot of the projects that I do, but if you like precision, I suggest you use a tape measurer because once again, here I am using science and a pencil. I can imagine it'll be so bad. I don't know what will happen if my measurements are off. I guess we'll find out. I got my swag hooks and my chains. So then I went ahead and did the same thing on this side. I put the ceiling hooks up in the ceiling and screwed them on. But wait a minute. Plot twist. Something unexpected is about to happen. No! No! I broke my swag hook. What are the chances? So then I went and stole a different ceiling hook out of my bathroom ceiling. It wasn't the same color, but I was able to finish the project. That's all that matters. Now, I could leave it just like that, but I want to add some lights to it. I'm give it a little bit of my own touch. <laughs> 